My name is Casey Gray. John Bowser. Darcy. Brian. Zanderson. Dan. Carter. Jacob Cover. Chad St. Louis. Jared Gale. First thing that came to mind was teamwork. Long. Eventful. Busy, I guess. Very busy. Pretty amazing. Interesting. Budget reports. Grow. Uh, currently, I'm most proud of the uh, the uh, kitchen that uh, me and my colleague Anderson did on uh, uh, downtown Ottawa. It was a six month reno. We renovated the, the kitchen, the living room, uh, and then we sided the outside. Uh, it was uh, my first uh, start to finish job, so I'm pretty proud of that one, and it turned out great. The clients are really happy. So. For 2019, my biggest accomplishment or what I was most satisfied with was definitely seeing how much I've grown and I know it's only been eight months, but at least seeing how much I've personally grown and gaining confidence on site and with the trades and feeling that I've been growing more as an efficient carpenter. I am most proud of how the team has become more of a team in 2019. Probably one of the projects I'm most proud of that I got to work on this year was um, it was a new kitchen uh, blending into a very old home. Um, I got to do a lot of very interesting woodworking there, a lot of good trim work, um, making uh, some custom trim to blend in with the old original trim that was there, but also to mix in with the new paint grade trim that we installed in the kitchen. Probably because it turned out the best and it turned out like exactly what the clients wanted. Um, and like the client, they're super happy. I'm super proud of it. I feel like we're progressing, but nothing really stands. I can't think of anything that really stands out. But um, I think we're just getting better. I think that the content's getting better. Uh, Casey's getting better. And yeah, everything's slowly getting better. And subscribers is going up, so we should be, we should be monetized soon on YouTube. Most recently is, uh, is getting the office and, and the team on site uh, synced up in terms of what exactly is happening and the changes that are being proposed. So, uh, not to circle around budget reports all the time, but I think that is uh, that's a big one where we we thought we we had a handle on something. Uh, there's still still communication. So, so communication, 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 and that that's not only between uh, the sites um, and the customers, but also with the office as well. well I was building uh, my own house. I probably get uh, Sean to do all the uh, finish work naturally. Uh, Anison to uh, deal and harass with all the subs. I get uh, Darcy to get everything organized and um, make sure everything flows as smoothly as well, everything that he does. <laughs> and, um, and then uh, Jacob and Carter uh, offer the support that they do and make it run smoothly. And for myself, I guess, um, sort of a little bit of everything. Darcy's framing. <laughs> Uh, Dan's doing a little bit of everything, for sure. Anderson's concrete, for sure. But he knows how to put things together. Um, I don't know. Sean gets anything that's kind of weird, different, tricky. Um, things that I would just get frustrated at because it's not going fast enough. It just, he'll just sit there and like make it work perfectly. And it never takes him that long too, which is hilarious. Like I sit there and go like, man, it's going to take me hours to do and Sean's like yeah I got that done um I don't know Dano keep everyone happy just positive vibes every day Anison I don't think he's a good taper but his framing seemed pretty pretty solid the mudding and taping is one of the least thing I like to do I like to do like little hole patches here and there but a big job it's just not not worth my time to do uh, I'd like to get better at it, but to be better at it, I need to be taught the right way, the fastest way to do it. So, and then Casey, I would uh, make him go away. So I'd be like, I can't afford you. So I would have to say that Sean is really excellent with doing his timesheets, and as well with getting his receipts in almost immediately. Darcy, well. That's, he's getting better. Let's just put it that way. He has improved at least 110%, 5% of 
following him would now be Dan. He's a work in progress. So the most interesting task I've been on or most interesting site I've been on so far with the Conscious Builder has been and the reason that was the most interesting because that's the first project that I was able to complete from start to finish and that was really special to see from gutting it down to building it back up and seeing the final product was really special. I mean yeah the smoothies that were all were pretty good. He was a smoothie person. Me and Sean we'd be up on ladders um, doing framing all covered in dirt and uh, the homeowner as nice as it was would come out with a uh, a uh, fancy dainty red glass <laughs> with a straw handed to us while we're up on the ladder <laughs> and we'd have to stop because it's sort of a sort of seems a little bit out of place <laughs> us covered in dirt uh, doing uh, destructive demo and uh, framing and we have to <laughs> we have this fancy smoothie cup <laughs> uh, working with the conscious builder for about a year really made me appreciate who I am as a carpenter instead of just the number. Uh, I felt like I'm part of the family, I'm part of a team here, that everybody knows who my kids are and I know who their significant others are. It's a nice heartwarming company and I really enjoy working for this company. You know, my Tyler, our, our, our Tyler, will always talk about Barry yelling at me. That's the only time I really remember getting yelled at though and it was something hilarious, it was like, we didn't have long enough Tapcons for him on site to attach the the new generator panel to the wall. And as well, I was like, hey, Barry, I'm pretty sure it's your job to bring Tapcons. Like, I don't think it's my job to bring you Tapcons. Um, I do have one confession for Casey. There is there is one interview that I, I totally messed up on that uh, it actually didn't record. So. That was kind of embarrassing and I didn't mention it to him so I think he kind of like forgot about it but now he probably, I don't know, I'm curious if he remembers who it was. Um, but I did record it, like I did record after some talking points but I just felt like, yeah, I really missed out on that. Uh, the number one piece of advice you would give to people who are uncomfortable speaking in front of people? Uh, you're going to suck until you're good. And so start doing it bad until you get good. And in other words, just start. It's all gonna be fine. Hey guys, Riley here in Dawson City, Yukon. Uh, minus 48 degrees right now. Uh, coldest place in the world yesterday. So I uh, hope you guys are all really excited to come and check out my hotel here. Here's a little preview. Just finishing up some details here. It was great working with you guys. Uh, some of you guys who are new to the team, maybe we'll get a chance to work together in the future. You never know. Uh, I want to take this opportunity for you guys to go to uh, DawsonLodge.com and sign up. You know what, just swipe up or just click the link below here. Have fun with that, Brian. We'll say 2020 is the year of actually setting your nails when you install trim. Don't not set your nails. <laughs> I'm super picky. <laughs> I guess, yeah, just keep doing your thing. I feel like they do the hard work. They, they throw the hammer and I just record it. And KC does a little talking. Well, I honestly would say to the team that they are one of the best people I've ever worked with. And we've been improving all our internal systems and operations and procedures. And I just love how they're always open to try something different. And so starting for 2020, I know we're gonna have some awesome ideas and awesome plans that we're putting into place. And I wouldn't want it with anybody else but you guys. You guys rock. Have fun, work hard. Uh, as I tell my kids, every day is learning. Even dad learns every single day. And uh, this team is still learning, but uh, we figure everything out together because we're such a great team and easy to get along. And uh, 2020 is a good year to come. Uh, let's just keep going, keep growing, and uh, have a good time, I guess. Uh, towards the team, I just want to thank everyone. They've been really welcoming for me as a new guy and me being pretty green, that coming in fresh, that with not a lot of site experience, they've been really good helping me and bringing me along and bringing me aside, explaining the task to me, not just throwing me to the wolves. 
to get me to do it, but kind of teaching me, walking me through it, and then letting me experience it for myself. And then when I do make a mistake, seeing how I made a mistake and how I can further correct that mistake later on down the road. Message is to continue to have fun. Uh, that's really important. That's, that's, that's part of our values, is to have fun and, and obviously take pride in your work, uh, as you should. Uh, the quality of the work is fantastic. It's the feedback that we're getting from our customers. And uh, keeping that up, uh, the company is just going to do uh, even better for 2020. So keep it up. Great work, guys. 2019 has been a blast. I'm looking forward to 2020 and all the, the, the fun and progress that we have uh, to look forward to. You guys are great. 2020 is going to be the year of growth. Uh, I've already said that my word, so to speak, is surrender. And that does not mean that I'm surrendering as in throwing in the towel. That means that I am here to serve and help in any way I can. Yep, just gonna install a piece of metal here and finish the exterior caulking on a window up here off this ladder. Um, shouldn't take too long and then everything's water sealed on the exterior here. Typically I have to wait for the warmer months to do a proper job. There are some extreme cocks out there, but uh, we'll make do with what we have here. I said ex extreme cock. Sorry, I should have said extreme <laughs> weather caulking. If you can, there's some caulking that works. I enjoy problem solving the most because at the end, we'll see. <laughs> We'll see the final result. Uh, easy peasy. That's what I usually say. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. <laughs> Actually, yeah, just clap one more time.